Install Zotero Browser Connector. Now in the previous video, we installed the Zotero desktop software, but we still need to install a browser connector so that you can save references, sometimes even full text PDFs from your browser to Zotero. If you use Google Docs, this step will add a Zotero tab to your Google Docs menu. Now this works with Firefox, Chrome, and Edge. It's also possible to use Zotero with Safari, but the process is a little different, and I'll explain that near the end of this video. Now, if you're not still there from last video, we're going to navigate to zotero.org slash download. That's z-o-t-e-r-o dot org slash download. Once there, on the right side of the screen, there's an Install Connector button. If your current browser isn't listed here, you can select Zotero connectors for other browsers and select the Install button for the browser you want. So I'm going to select Install Firefox Connector, and I'm going to permit the installation when prompted. I've now got a Zotero icon in the shape of the letter Z in my browser's toolbar, which shows that the browser connector has been installed. Note that once you start using the connector, the icon will change appearance to match the type of information Zotero can identify in your browser window. The, the icon can appear as a document for a journal article or an open book for a book chapter, for example. Now, if you want to use Zotero with Safari, the process is a little different. Once you've installed and opened Zotero desktop software uh, on your Mac, open Safari. From the top menu, select Safari, then Preferences. Select the Extensions tab and place a check next to Zotero to enable the Zotero browser connector in Safari. So, now we've installed both the desktop software and the browser connector and we're ready to start using Zotero.